no, 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 no. I, I liked it until you took it just too far. Too far. Well, I was just finding where the line is. No, 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 that's the line. My name is Chuck Klausmeyer. I'm playing Giles. I met Bill early on, and I love this guy from the minute I met him. And I met Bill working at the voice caster, or I met him before I started working there. He's actually got me a job there, you know, directing and working with him, and we would direct each other. He's the guy that taught me you only compete with yourself. You don't compete with everybody else. You just compete with yourself. You be the best you that you can be, and that's all you can do. I met Shane through Bill. He's a great guy, great sense of humor. Anybody who can put up with Bill has got to be good at what they do. So I, so I had respect for Shane immediately, just knowing that they were partners. I, I would say that uh, for this, there was, uh, uh, for, for Giles, it, he was a different character in the sense that he was gruffer, um, more of a killer. I don't want to give it away as to what to expect from Giles. But from Car Serum, if you, First of all, if you haven't seen Car Serum, I don't know why you'd be watching this, but I I really enjoy it. I think I think it's really really well done. But it, but it's like it's not the kind of thing that I'm normally drawn to. And in particular, this is all in, you know, your mind. It's there's no visual aspect to it, and there's so much production value that really fills in those gaps. It just really makes it interesting just the like the the distance of characters from one another and you can tell, you know, the when Godric is running off and on the horse and the sound of it going, you, you know, you just get a depth perception of what's happening and it's really, it's really interesting. And um, the production value is really, really high. Uh, I, I, was, I was very impressed. I produce a podcast myself, but it's, it's as I was telling them earlier, <laughs> the production value is virtually nil. I wrote a little guitar sting, you know, uh, I got my buddy Gary Giambo to play it. And, you know, we put it in there and that's it. And most of the time, Mike records from uh, his uh, kitchen table. You can also find me on Discovery Plus in a show called Six Degrees with Mike Rowe, which is, you know, like Six Degrees of Separation or Six Degrees of Kevin Bacon is what it is. It's a show about connections. Uh, so like, you know, one of the episodes is how a horseshoe can find your soulmate. And you think, what? Two disparate things, six degrees, a jagged line to get from one to the other. And it's very interesting.